August 18, 2011. This is the monastery, the monasterio from San Antolin, the Bedon, in northern Spain. It's a pity. It's it uh, looks like this. I made a promise a few years ago that if I earn enough money, I will um, restore this church and, uh, and the buildings and uh, ground my Delfino Center, which I'm founding in Holland right now. I will um, put it here and restore everything as it should be. This is too beautiful to let go and to let it tear down. Such a shame. Right now my Delfino Center in Holland is, is rather small in my house. It's a spiritual center. But I promise that I will make it bigger and as spiritual as can be if, if I could restore this, this church and, and build some new houses as a spiritual Delfino Center. If you want, want to find more, more, uh, more about me, just check DelfinoCenter.com. Right now I'm busy and building up my, my little center and I wrote a book about losing weight in a spiritual way and I translated it into English. I'm quite busy with editing it for the last time then I will publish in English and Dutch and after that I will develop a lot of, uh, a lot of exercises and, and uh, activities in my center. My goal has always been to help people as a male nurse, a teacher in nursing, sports instructor. And after overcoming my own obese overweight, I put all my experience, my knowledge and my everything in, in my book about losing weight for good. And I did lo lose weight for good because I live by my book. So who knows? Maybe in a few years, I, this is looking much better than it is now. And if anyone would like to join me and help me to restore this place, feel free to contact me. You'll find me at www.delfinocenter.com and you know uh, by there, um, by looking at my site, how to find me and to how to contact me. If you're interested in my book, please feel free to contact me too. Everything is on the site. First I want to visit um, the United States of America from end of November till after Christmas to do some book promotion. And I fly to Florida because Florida was the place where I lived as a student and I still regard it as my second home. Hope to see some people again and hope to do something with my book over there. I don't have to become a millionaire, that's not my goal. My goal is writing, helping people and be a spiritual person. I've always been a spiritual person. I'm a Christian. But if I do earn some millions, which is a very big dream. That's a dream I can't dream of, sorry. Then I would buy, hope to buy this if it's possible, and restore. And my first dream is to go on riding, second is helping people, and I would like to build up my Delfino Center and move it from Holland to this place in northern Spain. It's right at the coast. And the uh, mountains are behind us, and in front of here is a few mountains. It's wonderful. And I can almost cry because this is the fourth time I'm standing here in a couple of years. And I can almost cry that a church so beautiful like this is just getting more and more demolished and, and isn't being used anymore because it's a place of worship. I would love to have people have services here and come together 
in a spiritual way. I don't know if it's closed or not. Oh, it's open. Look what a beautiful church we could make out of this. It's still possible because it's it's actually it's still quite in good condition. But of course we cannot wait so many years because time look at the houses over here. Time is killing and all the plants and vegetables and and trees are growing into this because there's no maintenance. So what are we going to do about this? Lord, I promise you, if I'm able to, I will restore this. I will close the door, I don't know if it helps, but it's a sh shame there's even poop on the floor. Such a shame. Hey Jackie, wouldn't you want to live here and restore this and build some small houses in this place and let people of all over the world gather together here?